Hello everyone. Welcome to this course Altrex for beginners. In this course we would be discussing all about a tool called Altrex. We would be learning its practical concepts and we would be also seeing that why is it so useful. Also I would be showing you the procedure through which you can use it into your day-to-day -day lives. Also we would be seeing that what difference it is going to make and how it is going to prove useful to us. So in this video we are going to introduce ourselves to this particular tool and discuss about its features so that you can decide whether to go for this course or not. So this is the first video introduction to Altrix. Let us start by understanding that what actually is Altrix. So Altrix is a tool that is primarily used for data cleaning. So whenever you have a data set with you and you want to clean it then 90% of the task of data cleaning can be done automatically through Altrix. Apart from this, the different features provided by Altrix are all combined into this slide. Altrix is not just only a data cleaning tool, but it is also a predictive analysis tool. Predictive analysis means that a variety of statistical techniques are combined from uh, like data mining, predictive modeling and machine learning, which will analyze the historical trends and will make predictions about the future. So for this purpose, we can use Altrix. If you want spatial analysis, that is uh, when you want to analyze the locations, uh, relationships or basically the proximities in a geospatial data to extract the insights, then you can use this tool Altrix. Altrix also acts as an ETL tool that means to extract, transform and load uh, the general procedure uh, of copying the data from one source to destination which can then be used to visualize the data or represent it in a completely different format. Altrex also acts as a data blending tool that means you can get a data from the different sources and then merge it into a single data warehouse or a basically a data set and then analyze it. Last but not the least Altrex is a self service analysis tool. Now what is uh, this mean cell service analysis tool? So once you have created something called a workflow in Altrix, now you do not need to create it again and again. What you can do is simply combine the Altrix to just uh, follow the same procedures that you have done up till now and Altrix would automatically do the same tasks for you. Means you can just create the workflow once and use it as many times as you want. There is no limit on uh, using it, you can create once, use many times. Now let us understand that why should we use Altrix. So these are some of the features that helps us to understand that why Altrix is so much important for us. First of all, no coding knowledge is needed for this tool. It has a very simple interface. If you have a knowledge of Excel and some of the features of Excel like pivot tables or VLOOKUP, then you can simply use Altrix for all of your needs. So that is why if you do not have a strong coding background, then you can use Altrix as well. It has a very simple drag and drop interface. All of the filters or all of the features, all of the tools that you want to use that you can simply just drag and drop. Suppose you want to sort the data. So we have a sorting tool provided to us in Altrix. All you need to do is drag it and drop it on your data set and the data set would be sorted. If you want to filter it according to a particular criteria, similarly, you can just drag the filter tool and drop it over there and that particular filter would be applied. It is compatible with different data sources around uh, 80 plus data sources are supported by Altrix. That means uh, you can use the data set which is in any format. It could be in the form of an Excel file, a CSV file or basically a semi-structured or unstructured JSON file as well. You can simply use it in Altrix, import it in Altrix and actually analyze it using the tool because it supports a variety of data sources. The integration with the Power BI tools uh, with the business intelligence tools like Power BI, Tableau, ClickSense is also provided to Altrix. So once you have created some of the insights in those tools, you can easily interact with that report or with that dashboard using Altrix. You can actually make a connection between those two and get a better insight of your data. Now, uh, 
The last but not the least, it is actually the most important feature of Altrix that is it provides automation of the manual tasks. So all the tasks that you had been doing manually up till now, you can actually automate them with the help of Altrix. And once you have automated those tasks and once the workflow is created, you do not have to create it again and again. Simply you can reuse it as many times as you want. Now let us take a look at some of the features of Altrix and these are the same features that make it so special. So first of all is that it supports 80 plus data sources as we have already discussed. The data uh, files that you are using in Altrix can be in any format like a CSV file, an Excel file, a JSON file, XML file, HTML file, any type of a file. If it contains data, it is supported by Altrix. You can simply just use it, you can import it in Altrix and then uh, analyze it. One more thing, this uh, number of the data sources is actually increasing as new versions of Altrix are being released. So uh, even if your uh, data source is not compatible right now, it might come in the future. It supports all the formats of data, like it may be a structured data in the form of a SQL. It could be semi-structured or unstructured data in the form of a JSON files. So whatever the format of the data is, it is supported by Altrix. You don't have to worry about the data format if it is not in a tabular format or so. There are two 60 plus automation tools that are available for analytics in Altrix. Now these automation tools not only reduce our tasks, but also make the analysis and the data cleaning process very smooth. Like you want to filter out some records, you want to sort out some records, all you got to do is just use these automation tools through a simple drag and drop and use them on your data set and just see that how it works. You do not need to uh, perform complex procedures, you do not need any kind of a coding knowledge for this purpose, just drag and drop. Report creation is supported from different data sources. That means uh, the different BI tools or the different data sources, you can create reports using those. Like once you have created a report or a workflow in Altrix, then uh, you can actually use the different data sources for different sorts of visualizations to be combined together in a single report. So this is one of the best features supported by Altrix. Now, once you have created the report and you want to share it with uh, your team or with a different sets of people, then you can uh, export this report in the different file formats that are supported by uh, Altrix, like PDF, Excel file or many more. Uh, and also with the upcoming versions, this number of uh, file formats that are supported by Altrix is also increasing. Finally, Altrix supports the reusable workflows. What does it mean? It means that once you have created a workflow, you can reuse it as many times as you want. You do not need to just perform those same steps again and again and again. You can just simply reuse the workflow that you have already created. So this is about the features of Altrix. And now, uh, since we know about the basics of Altrix and why is it so useful, let us see that how can we actually install Altrix into our systems. So it is a paid tool, but you can get a trial version of 14 days for yourself. So we would be just using that trial version only right now. Okay. So for this, what you need to do is just basically Google Altrix. Here you will see this website, official website, www.altrix.com. In this official website, you need to go to this products option. So once this products option is open, you will see that these are these different products uh, that are available like designer, server, intelligence suite, etc. From this, we need to go with this designer product because it is uh, suitable for individuals. So let's just click on this learn more option. Once you click on this learn more option, uh, you will go to this home page of this particular product, which is Altrix designer uh, product. You can just read all about it, the system requirements and the features of this particular product. Then if you want to install it, you can just click on start free trial. If you want to watch a demo, you can just go with a demo video. Let's just click on start free trial. Now what will it do is it will ask you if you are a new user or if you are an existing user or whatever. So I'm a new user. Let's just click on a new user download now button. Now, what will you do is it will ask you all of these details. So uh, you, what you need to do is just actually provide all these details. And once you have provided these details, you can click on confirm. Once you will click on confirm, the downloading process for an exe file will start for you. So uh, 
that's it that's the simple process for downloading this particular setup now how will we install it this is something that we will see in the next video that's all for this one thanks for watching bye